I'd like to introduce to you members of the Country Music Hall of Fame and the citizens of Fort Payne, Alabama, the legendary group Alabama. Thank you all very much. And a kid that grew up and went to school at Adamsburg Junior High School. Dropped out of school. Tried to go back to high school. Was discouraged every way possible by the principal. But because of a lady named Mary Ellis, I was encouraged to go back to high school. I got my degree here at Fort Payne High School with the help of several really wonderful teachers that encouraged me and changed my life forever. And uh, then I thought if I can go through all that and uh, be made fun of because the clothes I wear, I can do about anything. So it made me strong, made me grateful. It made me humble because the roots that I have with uh, my family are very well grounded. And, uh, and I think, uh, of course, we mentioned that my mother's here. She gave me life. I appreciate you being here, Mama, because uh, it's very important that you're here. And I want to leave you just my part of this with an old song we all know very well. And it goes like this, it twas grace. Next that brought me safe thus far and grace will lead me home. I thank you very much. Come on, Daddy. I want to make sure they're not coming to get me. Hold on. Well, uh, to have grown up in uh, this community here and uh, where my grandfather and my great-grandfather, everything that meant anything to me growing up was here in this area. And uh, although we went to a lot of places, this was still our favorite. And uh, I want to thank Joe Carpenter, Ed Turner, Bruce Burnett. These guys in the band here, that uh, most people have no idea what you go through as a band to uh, stay together and try to continue to form for people. This is the greatest honor we could ever have right here among the folks that we love the most. Thank God for giving us the strength over these years to stay healthy and stay together and to achieve what we achieve. All the guys on on the road, Greg, Steve, Jeff Brooks, all those guys that were our brothers on the road. That's what we miss most of all is that family, I think. But we still got each other and we still love each other. And thank you all for being here today. And we're just so thankful that uh, we live to see this day. I, I don't know about the rest of these fellas, but I've been down here making friends with the pigeons for a <laughs> Teddy, that was, that was awesome, man. I, I hear what you're saying, bro. Uh, you know, the, the farewell tour is over, and it's been a while. It's, it's great to see all the friends and fans still come back here, just like we always do. And... Uh, I, I want to especially thank you, Johnny, for inviting me down here and the rest of the city council. Uh, I, I'm, I'm really glad I came. I, I can't tell you how good it is to see everybody again. It's amazing to me to uh, look back here and see these statues to what I consider to be three hairy-legged guitar pickers and a drummer. <laughs> But I do think it has some significance to me. <clears throat> to have my family here. And even though my dad can't be here, 
It's right across the street from where he sold auto parts for about 40 years. All the other guys that have spoken here this morning have thanked all the people. I would not go through that again. It's the same people that have helped them that helped me. And uh, I just want to thank the city council and everybody involved to make this happen today. And I think it's probably the greatest honor we could ever get. And my heart